Imagine a place where mutilated dolls hang from trees, their vacant eyes staring into nothingness. Welcome to the Island of the Dolls, Mexico. Shrouded in the chilling legend of Don Julian Santana Barrera and a drowned girl, the island is a haunting testament to a tragic tale. These dolls, weathered and disfigured, are said to be the vessels of lingering spirits, infusing the island with an eerie atmosphere that's hard to shake. Whether or not you believe in ghosts, there's no denying the unsettling feeling that fills the air in this remote corner of Mexico City. From an island in Mexico, we move to a forest in Japan, a forest that whispers tales of despair, the Aokigahara Forest. This dense woodland located at the base of majestic Mount Fuji carries a somber reputation as the suicide forest. It's a place where too many have chosen to end their lives, making it one of the most haunting places on earth. The forest is not just known for its high suicide rate. It is believed to be a dwelling place for Yurai, or ghosts of the departed. The stillness of the forest, combined with the chilling stories of the spirits that roam here, create an eerie, unsettling atmosphere that is hard to shake off. But as we leave the shadows of the Aokigahara, we find ourselves stepping back in time to the ancient city of Pompeii. Pompeii was once a thriving Roman city, full of life and culture. However, in 79 AD, the eruption of Mount Vesuvius buried the city under a thick layer of ash and lava. The city and its inhabitants were frozen in time, preserved remarkably well under the volcanic debris. Today, visitors to Pompeii can walk through the ancient streets, pass by the well-preserved buildings, and even see the casts of the people who perished in the eruption. These figures, frozen in their final moments, create an uncanny, strange feeling that lingers. It's as if the city and its inhabitants are still waiting for a day that will never come. These places, steeped in history and tragedy, serve as stark reminders of human frailty, and the relentless march of time. They are the echoes of our past, the whispers of stories long gone, and the silent observers of the world as it moves forward. They are in their own way witnesses to the complexities of the human condition and the unforgiving force of nature. And they continue to fascinate, terrify, and remind us that we are but small players in the grand theater of life and death. From the haunted forests and cities, we move to buildings and cemeteries, each with its own chilling tale to tell. In the heart of California, the Winchester Mystery House stands as a testament to one woman's fear and obsession. Sarah Winchester, widow of William Wirt Winchester, heir to the Winchester Repeating Arms Company, constructed this sprawling mansion over a span of 38 years. Believing she was haunted by the spirits of those killed by Winchester rifles, Sarah Winchester embarked on a never-ending construction project, resulting in a maze-like house filled with staircases leading to nowhere, doors opening to brick walls, and windows overlooking other rooms. The house's peculiar architecture and the stories of phantom footsteps, cold spots and strange voices make it a magnet for ghost hunters and those fascinated by the paranormal. On the other side of the world, in the city of love, Paris, lies the Père Lachaise Cemetery. It's the final resting place of many famous figures, from Jim Morrison to Oscar Wilde. But it's not just the famous residents that draw visitors. Ghost stories abound, with tales of spectral figures wandering among the tombstones, strange sounds echoing in the night, and a chilling atmosphere that can make even the bravest soul uneasy. These sights, filled with tales of the supernatural, continue to fascinate and terrify us making them some of the most terrifying places on earth. From haunted islands to eerie forests, abandoned cities to mysterious buildings, our journey has taken us to some of the most terrifying places on earth. We've ventured into Mexico's island of the dolls, where mutilated dolls hang in morbid tribute to a drowned girl. We've tread lightly through Japan's Aokigahara forest, where the spirits of the departed are said to linger. We've walked the silent streets of Pompeii, frozen in time by a volcanic eruption, and descended into the shadowy depths of Poland's Wielitska salt mines. We've explored the ghost town of Pripyat, standing testament to a nuclear disaster, and navigated the labyrinthine Winchester Mystery House, a mansion riddled with unsettling secrets. 
We've traced the footsteps of history in Père Lachaise Cemetery and shivered at the chilling tales of Blenheim Palace. We've pondered over the enigmatic Nazca lines and braved the desolate expanse of Death Valley. These places, despite their chilling reputations, remind us of the fascinating and often eerie side of our world's history. Until the next journey, stay curious and keep exploring.